I've been warned and you are being warned too that this is going to be the worst Kilua toy resin figure made by FL Studio. Hunter x Hunter is making noise around the world with its comeback. I know that Korapika is the center of the Succession War arc, but still, the most popular character in the anime is Kilua. That's based on the research of my anime list. I will link it down below. By the way, big thanks so much to Japan Anime Figure for letting us have this Kilua toy for this episode. Link down below the description box. So let's cut the chase and start reviewing the worst Kilua toy resin statue in the world right now. Alright, let's proceed in opening it. I don't know how come it become it became this small, but it is what it is. It has two layers of the soft box. So this one, the first layer would be the effects, entirely effects. I can see a lot of lightning here. And then the lower layer, the second layer would be, uh, I think this is Kilua because I can see here the feet. So let's start opening it. We always start with the base. Okay, we have the body here of Kilua and it has the peg here. So I assume the feet should go here. We have here the face. I don't know how come they made it look like a transparent one. Yeah, I think it has an alternate head, solid color, and I prefer this one, to be honest. See? So this is much better than the transparent one. So you put the head. Not bad. Or head holder. So if you don't like the transparent one, you can put it there. Like this. Nice. All right, I see. How come people doesn't like this one because of the quality of the head? It looks like it's like a cut head, straight cut head. All right, arm one. Because this is very iconic on Tulua's storyline. I think the problem here would be there's just too much effects. I don't know how to find each and every one of them. Like, where should this one go? For example, that lightning. I have no idea that it should be there. You just have to do it. You just have to wink everything on it. I'm just guessing. <laughs> but seems like it. How to build this one? That one looks like it should go here on its feet. Yeah, that's correct. That looks correct. So there you have it guys, this is the FL Studio Kilua Zoldic and unfortunately I really can't figure it out uh, where the effect should be so I'm not really sure if this is entirely correct and what I have here is an excess effects and or an effect and I can't find where it should fit. There's a hole here but I really can't figure it out. I tried looking it over Google and YouTube, unfortunately there are no guides about it. So I think that's one problem on this toy statue is that there is no guide on where the effect should go. You just really have to figure it out on your own. Another thing that I saw, which I might think people doesn't like, would be this. Look at the transparent head. You can actually see the cut of the head of Kilua here. So you can see the inside of it. It looks like a hollow head. That's why probably uh, I'd rather go for the solid color. To be honest with you guys, I don't think this is the worst. I think this is pretty decent. It's just that I really can't figure it out on how to build it. But overall, the face structure uh, on this one, it's good. The facial expression of Kilua is pretty much on point. So another point on that one. The color as well, it's okay. It's just that the way they did the hair, it's a bit messy. Overall, guys, I think this is pretty decent, especially for its price point. Uh, not bad, not bad. So guys, enjoy the montage of this Kilua by FL Studios in 3, 2, 1. By the way guys, I placed the other effects on his arm and it kind of suits on that part. So I, I assume that this is the correct one. I'm still lacking one more here and I don't know how to put it in. So there you go. Guys, thank you for watching this episode. I hope I was able to help you with this Kilua by FL Studio and hope you like this one. That's everything on this episode. So thank you for watching and I'll see you again next time. Bye.